Tyler Scott, and I'm in the Electrical Technology Program at Northwest Shells Community College in Muscle Shells, Alabama. In this video, I'm going to explain our control box and what's inside that controls our car wash that my instructor, Ray Morris, challenged us to do. Come take a look, I'll show you how it works. When you first plug this in, after the system boots up, our system radio light comes on, letting you know when it's operational. And we have two different options on our car wash. You have a wax or an underspray during your wash. These options can only be chosen before you push the start button. Whatever option you choose, whenever you push the button, the corresponding light lights up, letting you know it has been selected. After you have selected your options, you push the start and the car wash takes place. At any time, you can hit the emergency stop button, which kills all power to all field devices. <clears throat> now this system is run off of Allen Bradley Compact Logix 5000. I have made a tag sheet which explains all the terminal spots that all of our wires are landed from our field devices. All of our wires have a certain number to them, and I have a brief description explaining what they control. Now down here we have two power supplies. We have a 24 volt DC and a 12 volt DC power supply. <clears throat> These send power to our sensors and this sends power to our pumps. Now down here we have our master control relay. Our, this contactor is controlled by our stop button. Whenever the stop button is out, the coil is energized like it is right now. Whenever the stop, stop button is pushed, the coil de-energizes, which kills power to our two power supplies. So no field devices can be energized when it's pushed. <clears throat> now down here on our relays, we have them labeled on what they are. And the labels are explained by the tag sheet. <clears throat> so right here we have CM. So if we go to our tag sheet and look at the description, if we go down and find CM, we can trace it back and see that it controls the conveyor motor. So this relay right here controls our main drive. <clears throat> so this right here is our roller motors, which is what cleans the car off. This is our water pump. This is our soap pump. And this is our wax pump. And these two control our fans. And this right here is a, tur a transformer, which controls our 24 AC underspray control valve. Now down here, I have our different terminals labeled. And you can see this is 120 voltage right here, AC. We have 24 positive and minus DC. Right here we have 12 minus DC. These terminals right here control all of our I.O., which is our inputs and outputs. These red ones right here are our inputs from our sensors, and these fuse terminals right here is what controls our outputs. So this is all the basics that our car wash is run off of. <clears throat> and I appreciate you watching this video. We will make another video explaining some problems that we have had and encountered along the way. And I thank you for your time for watching.